Hey guys, Mizuki's Bush here, and I was kind of searching through houses, found some ammo, some things like that, some actually yaka juice, yoka, yaka I think it's that because there's no O in it, no, it just not stupid, and I kind of shot a zombie and this is what happened. I raised the spawning up to high instead of normal, and this is what happened, so... I'm bringing you guys my journey to fight them all. And I don't have any melee weapons. Or no gas for my girl that I found at the gas station. Let's just hope I can get all these guys and get back to the Caleb cave in one piece. I don't care if they follow me, but I know there I have my SMG because I just put that. Because I just got an airdrop with the schematics to it. And that's why I've been kind of going out, stealing air duds to get some scrap metal, and just things like that. But, shit kind of got real, and it's almost nighttime too. So it's roughly 5 o'clock, or actually no, it's 6 o'clock. Just subtract 12 from the 18. And that's what time it is, in the 50 it's 6.51, 6.50, yada yada yada. I don't like these guys right there. The big guys, those are just bad news. And I have a broken leg because I fell out of a tree. Okay, uh, let's be honest. I tried jumping on the tree. And it didn't work out so well because you can't really jump on trees. Like, my buddy lied to me and told me that you could. I don't know why I believed him. He's never played this game. Uh, that's what kind of threw me off about him knowing that you can jump on trees. He's like, oh, I saw Rooster Teeth do it. But, yeah, broke my leg. I had, to, I had to go raid a tent nearby camp to get some cloth. Okay, let's try to let's get some distance you now. This stuff's amazing, by the way. Look at that. Both. No downsides. Ooh, ooh, why, why is that doing that? Oh no, oh don't crash. Oh great, one of these guys. Bam. Bam, 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 bam. Yep, okay. Trying to make it back to the fortress of manlytude. Just this way. Down the main road over here. I hope I can get there in time. My broken leg, you know, I'm moving kind of like a bit of a bitch and everything. But let's just hope. Yeah, this thing's fucking awesome. I'll show you guys what I do with that in a sec. If I can get over there. We kind of had some fun with it. I found this in a chainsaw at a gas station in the desert. I'll actually show you when I get to safety. And it was pretty fun. Kind of wanted to tear down a house. I'd actually have a tunnel going from this house to the Fortress of Manly Tude or the Caleb Cave. All you fairly odd parents lovers out there. Oh, yeah. Well, just a manly too. Let's see. Okay. Mix some more of this juice. Get some stamina. So I really don't want to. You can see where the Caleb Cano used to be after I got attacked. And that's just no good anymore. I just got fucked up, dude. Right there. So. I should have really brought a shovel. I'll chance and use this. Uh, I'm in. I'm in and undetected. Is this a fake video? Dude. Oh shit. No, not so much. Oh god. Okay. I gotta dig out a little bit more. Okay. Clip that dirt. It's boom. Boom. I don't care, it's a single player world. I built a tungsten door right here. Very handy. I love it right there. Just in case they do follow me in, I have at least a little bit of time to get down to the Caleb Cave, grab an SMG out of my gun safe right here, and at least defend myself, really. That's really all I can ask for. The 44, amazing, really loud. Don't recommend it if you're going to a suburban area like that. And near your base. 
but this is what I've been doing for like the past five to six hours digging out this big hole simply for the fact I like digging it's really fun this auger is amazing like it's a lot faster than this pick I wish there's like a way to mine faster not like enchantments like in minecraft but say I can build this and upgrade to like a diamond tip or a carbon tip instead of it just being iron I think that'd be pretty great you know uh, this is what my medical supplies are looking like. I'm doing pretty good here. Those crate drops. The one with the airplanes spawn like every 500 hours. Not 500 hours, like every day or something. Every 24 hours. I usually just go get that if they're close enough. It's been getting so many antibiotics. And, like those nurses are being like good guy nurses and dropping bandages for me. And, you know, you gotta support them by shooting them in the face. So. They don't go get your buddies and stuff, but if they get your buddies, I think it'd be pretty funny. Like, I'm trying to talk with my best friends into getting this game. He just doesn't have the money for it, because he's being a bitch. Not really. He's just poor. <laughs> and, I don't know, I just think it'd be fun to get this and lead a bunch of zombies to his base. Yeah, I think that'd be nice, actually. This is the hunting rifle by far, my favorite weapon in this game. I really don't know where this goes to. I don't remember. I think I was just digging this for the sake of digging it too. Or I think this is my emergency hatch, but I really don't think I'll be needing it. Yeah, it's my emergency hatch. There's ladders in the wall. A double door, just in case. Can they get in here? Give me some time to run away. Then this tunnel right here, these doors is, I think there's like five doors total in this place, if not six. I know there's no more than seven, but it, this goes all the way to the little suburban area. And I built this because I just thought it'd be cool to have like a little tunnel there, but we're still good. And I dug all this out with the pickaxe over the course of like two hours. It took forever. I mean forever. I fell on those a couple times. Don't get me wrong. You're like, Mizuki, how do you do that? You try to grab your Mount Dew, and it's to the right of your keyboard, and you're like, right in there. It, it's pretty fucking annoying. Right now it's about 8 o'clock. Am I stupid? I think I am. Yep. This goes into this place right here. It's all cemented off. There's a way to get on the roof. I want to snipe some zombies. You know, because I like killing stuff. This game is probably one of my favorite things about this. It's like all the mindless killing you can do. What's in here? I think all the loot just respawns because it respawns like every three days. Yeah. So. I can use that bullet case and things like that. There should be like a dead guy up here somewhere if I can find out where I'm at. Uh, yeah, right here. Okay. I kind of got a little happy with the chainsaw. Uh, I wish I didn't do that. I think there's a dead guy in here. No, it's still house next to me. Uh, ooh, bullet case. Those are always scrumptious. Gun saves. I found one that it took me like a minute to search. Dude, I was so freaking paranoid in that one minute. Urban combat. I don't think I can use these. I think I have all of them. It's piece unlocked. But I've killed a good amount of zombies in this game so far. Well, I think what's a good amount for this being my first world and everything. Okay, I lied. This is my first world that I actually got stuff in. I've had a couple worlds to walk around, like a creator world, and see what I can do and all that stuff. That's how I figured about the rock launcher, and I spent a while trying to get that. There's a hornet. I hate the. Yep, I hate these things. Dude. Oh my god. Like, ooh, look at that little fucker right there. Oh my god. No, I do not want you guys running over here right now. Yeah, this is all bad news right now. Because, like, they don't know where I'm at, but they know I'm around here somewhere. I think I'm in the house next to this. That's good. That means the little rooftop strategy I have working. I have it ladder laddered up right here because I think it would be easier for them to get upstairs than ladders. 
but as of now I'm gonna go back to the base because one I'm paranoid as fuck in this game because I don't want to die I already died once I don't want to do it again and because I had to walk all the way to here this little camp right there I got fucked up by some loggers because they're like frozen so they take more shots and this place over here this is where I found the drill and the chainsaw this is actually some hotel it's pretty nice probably have to walk over there again a little cowboy town didn't really like that there were a lot of zombies and I just dropped them again bad. And yeah now the zombies are gonna look there I shouldn't even have done that I should just have a crossbow I hope in the future they have like, muzzle brakes and things like that to silence your weapon or just hide the flash even though zombies and what people are said that the zombies they have really good hearing but really poor eyesight but I still think that little muzzle flash on it just getting that to tone down would help a lot with you trying to hide cause me I'm a paranoid motherfucker it's like I played this game in a multiplayer server not telling you guys which one but I was playing it and some dude was in my base so I killed him, took his stuff and left the game cause I didn't want him to come back and kill me like I took all my valuables and just left the games cause I don't want him to throw my boxes I don't even know if they can, because, you know, I'm paranoid over here. So I'm like, um, no, I'm, I'm good, dude. Like, yeah, sorry. Bye-bye. <laughs> I was being a little girl about it. And didn't want to really defend what I call my little home. That makes sense. I do. If When I get more gas, I don't have any, I don't think. If I do have a little bit, a little bit left from this. Oh, no. I can use obviously. Oh, I can. Hell yeah. No. No, I guess I can't anymore. I don't know if it's like different books or like the more I level up. But I'm gonna throw these in the fire right now. Just to get rid of them because I don't think I can break these down into paper. No, I can't. Actually, let me check. Break down item. Yeah, I can't break these down. But I usually just throw them in the the forge just leave them there but because it's like so close to the surface I have the fire right here I wonder if I can just do this yeah I can okay. I just leave that there my fridge is what it's looking like I know I got a lot of water so I've been going over to this place over here I found a lake really close to my house and it's not that close but like this one right here the little river the lake right there Right next to this little farmhouse. I actually found my first 44 Magnum part in there. Bless that guy for being a redneck. Thank God for them, dude. And yeah. I can go there, get the murky water, and I come over here. This is, this is another place that I actually have footage of me blowing this place up. And what happened was, is I wanted the concrete. Because, you know, I just wanted it. I was like survival game, trying to be greedy and take everything. That that was a death to me. That was this one death right here. It was one death. I fucking hate that right there, dude. Oh my god. So I was mining out the support beams because they're concrete supported, and I mined too many out at once without mining away the top, and it fell on the gas pumps and blew me up. You guys don't believe me? Go do it yourself. Like fucking for real. It was like, boom, you have died. Your score is da-da-da, or whatever it says when you die. I don't remember. I died once. I haven't really died much, but yeah. It was lame. You have no idea. I was so mad. Like, I'm in Skype with my girlfriend, and I was like, oh, that's so fucking stupid. I'm just a sour puss. A poor sport. I'll admit it. I don't care. He is probably better than me at this game anyway, because I know, I'm nothing good. I dig holes and hide underground at night. What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? What is this? It's a small stone. <laughs> I thought it was a rock. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> oh my god. This game, man. I, I, when a buddy told me to buy this because he thought it was cool, we are actually supposed to get it together, but he never had the money to get it, and I was like, well, I just bought a Steam card, so I'm going to get it and check it out. So I got it, I don't know, 
I thought it was going to be like that wannabe survival crafting game, like everything on Xbox for Minecraft before Minecraft actually came out for Xbox. It was like blocks and stuff, but I was like, wait a second. Only the building aspect of it is blocks, but like not like that. But like the tool, like, um, I don't have anything in my inventory to show you, like what I mean by it. I don't think I can place potassium. I can't place potassium. That's cool. I like that stuff. That's what I used to make my TNT. Sometimes I'm scared when I mine it, it's gonna explode on me. But I guess it doesn't. I don't know. I'm just a really paranoid guy. <laughs> but as I was saying, like, I remember this one game, I forget what it was called. I think it was like Total Miner Forge. I used to play that on the Xbox when I was like 12 before Minecraft came out. I thought that was the shit. I, had, I always had Minecraft on the computer, but you know, Xbox, come on guys. I didn't really have that good of a computer. But I'm not a fan of PlayStation. Put that one out there. Feel free to hate in the comments. I don't care. I'll probably just won't respond to you, or I'll probably just block you from the channel because I really don't want anything negative on my channel. Because I really don't see why I should affiliate my myself or the people around me as negative. Or the people that watch my videos, like all three of you guys. <laughs> but as I was saying before, I just started to ramble. I thought it was just gonna be like one of those games. It's like every other game out there, like come on, the best realistic survival zombie game. But no. This game actually has some really good stuff. As you can tell, I broke my leg again. It healed. Then I fell down out of that tree and broke it again. Then it got to a sprained leg. Okay. Then, I don't know what happened. The roof that I was on earlier in the video, I walked off it. Again, that's going to take fucking 2,000 seconds to heal. It is some bullshit. Like, fucking really. Oh, I was so hot-headed. I was like, that's lay. What does this honey do? This stuff's pretty good too, I guess. The honey? Well, let's eat it. Let's find out. It says it has good stuff, but. Oh, I said only have like plus five fullness? Mm, this, yeah, I think it's actually the same. This, this gives me more stamina. This fruit? This is pretty good. It's better than a large beef ration. I got a couple of these from the airdrops. That been like every 24 hours. I like them. They give you a lot of food, but like if I want to have bread on me, it smells. It's like what? They're attracted to wheat? That's dumb. I can understand them being attracted to like raw pig and cooked pork and things like that. Like this stuff. I pull it out. They're attracted to it. Seeing a little nose right there. I put it back. I'm good. I don't really get that though. It's like hey, I smell something. I don't smell it anymore. So I'm not gonna go over there. Yeah. It's kind of. I wish the fridge had more space, to be honest. But I can like I have a bunch of water and stuff that just randomly spread out in these boxes because I'm not too organized. I could try being look at that. <laughs> iron gloves. What up? Like I tried being organized, but look, look, the gas mask is by far one of the coolest objects you can put on your face. That and the bandana. I don't know. So like, I wish they had bigger chests. So I don't have to make so many of these. Yeah, but. I don't know. <laughs> it's just a hassle. Alright guys, well, I think I'm gonna go because it's getting kinda late. The time I'm recording this is 10.30. It's my bedtime. I have school tomorrow. If I can get my 1C up in math, I'll have straight A's. Yeah. And I get to go to an aquarium with my mother because she says if I get straight A's, I can get a St. Bernard and go to the aquarium. I'm shooting for the St. Bernard, one of those things since I was little. These are awesome. They'll name it Beethoven because you kind of have to after this movie. Like a little fanboy. You're like, oh my god, a St. Bernard. I want it. It looks so fluffy. But <laughs> anyway, guys, this is Mizuki's Wish. I hope you enjoy this Seven Days to Die. If you guys want to play with me, let me know. So I was thinking about renting a server. You can come join, play. Just don't be a dick. Personally, it's the only thing I can suggest. And yeah, have a good morning, evening, night, and remember, you're beautiful, I love you, and you're worth something. Don't let anyone get you down. Alright, have a good day, guys. Bye-bye.